The U.S. House Judiciary Subcommittee on Immigration, Integrity, Security and Enforcement met in Grand Forks, North Dakota today to discuss concerns with the U.S. border and the impact of related issues on North Dakota residents and communities. Only Republicans on the bipartisan committee attended, but several called it a bipartisan issue. One of the main concerns on the northern border is fentanyl trafficking, with a North Dakota law enforcement official pointing out that it's more profitable for traffickers to on the north border where the drug can be sold for up to $80 for one pill compared to 25 cents for one pill on the southern border. Minnesota Congresswoman Michelle Fishbach attended the meeting and the hearing and said Minnesota is facing the same issues as North Dakota on the border. Uh, Mr. Armstrong said it during the hearing, you know, this is about policies. The policies are wrong and the policies need to be changed. And I will say, as we listen to that, President Biden has the opportunity to change this. He can do it right now. He can change these policies. He can return to the Trump administration's policies and shut this border down. And we need to shut all of the border down, not just the southern border, but the northern border. The hearing today titled The Biden Border Crisis, North Dakota Perspectives, was held at the Alaris Center. It was an official meeting for the subcommittee. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.